hello guys welcome back to my channel and thanks for clicking my name is esther asamoah and the channel name is esther asamoah tv you are all welcome to today's video in today's menu we are preparing ayoyo soup very delicious slimy and it tastes great and also it's simple in making it so guys follow the recipe and i hope you will try some at home if you have not subscribed to this channel please subscribe press the notification bell so that anytime i upload a video you'll be notified like share this video and let's dive into the video this is our main ingredient the ayoyo leaves so now i'm plugging out the ayoyo leaf from the stem Now, this is the leaf, the ayoyo leaf we are going to use in making this soup. So, first and foremost, I'm washing it. And please, um, since it just came out from the farm, you need to wash it very, very, very well. So, this one, I wash it three times. Yes. So, you wash it first one, then second one, then the third one. guys as i said earlier on you see how dirty the water is so i'm washing it for the second time yes you need to wash it thoroughly because we don't want to get stone or sand in the soup no we need to clean and wash it very well so you need to always wash your vegetables very well yeah we need to stay healthy So now you see the second wash, the water is somehow clean, but still I need to wash for the third one, the final wash, yes, I need to give it a final wash, then we continue. So this is the dry hairies and I'm removing the skin from it then also the gust yes I'm removing everything from it then I will blend them So here I'm breaking it into pieces before I blend them. This is my dawa dawa, that is my locust beans. So I've taken a portion and I'm blending it with the hairies.
this is my pot and I filled in with water I've blended the berries and the dawa dawa the locust beans together and now I'm adding it to my water so this time around I'm making the soup so this is how I start the soup so I'm stirring everything together then cover it for it to cook for about 10 minutes then I open it yes after cooking for 10 minutes this is how it looks like now I've chopped in some green chili pepper yes so I've added it to the soup I blended my ayoyo and this is how it looks like so I'm adding it to the soup this one is optional you can skip you can use only the ayoyo but me my ayoyo was small for me so I decided to add some small okra to it so for ayoyo soup you can cook only the ayoyo yeah without adding okra this one is optional I'm adding in my soda that's a cow shrimp cube I'm adding in some of the dawa dawa that is the low cost beans yes I'm adding some to the soup then stir everything together Now I'm adding in my chopped onions. If you have watched the video up to this time, God bless you so much. And if you have not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe, press the notification bell so that anytime I upload a video, you'll be notified. Give this video a thumbs up. Share to your family and friends so that they too will know about it. So guys, after cooking it for about 10 minutes, you see how slimy it is and at this point, it's okay. You can serve it with your tio, zafi, or banku, or eba, kongonte, Nigerians call it amara. Yeah. <laughs> yes it's so tasty so delicious and i hope guys you enjoyed watching this video please subscribe if you have not subscribed press the notification bell so that anytime i upload a video you'll be notified now i'm serving this soup with my tioza fee and i'll be bringing you the recipe of this tioza fee very very soon so we meet in our next video it's Bye-bye.